it's grown quite late, hasn't it? Oh man, what are we gonna do? The wall ain't going anywhere. Wait. A more pressing issue's arisen. I'm quite famished. Wow, what an issue! Come on, dude, get real! Oh, on second thought, I'm famished too. <laughs> Let's get something to eat. We can't have any good ideas on empty stomachs. Hungry? I'll find a restaurant for you. No need, Sophia. Our target's already been decided. Sojiro's courier boss! I bet he'll hook all of you up, too. Do you mean it? <sighs> Take it easy on boss, okay? He's already treated us plenty. Ugh, I don't even care. What's that? A fight? All those stupid bastards <gasps> making me look like crap. Oh, it's okay, sir. Hey, kids, get out of the way. Uh, just some plastered suit. Huh? Hey, what are these little shits doing out? Hey, you're a real looker. How's about you and I go back to my place? And... <laughs> hey, cut it out! Oh! Oh, you wanna fight? Please! Don't work him up any worse than he is already! What? He's the one who started it! Oh! That's it! I'm gonna... I'm gonna teach you all some manners! If you don't walk away... Alright, break it up, that's enough. What the hell is this? Hmm, how should I put it? I'm just a knight in shining armor. Uh, what? That's weird. Knight in shining armor, my ass! I'm gonna punch your lights out! Careful now! Ooh, you really ate it there. You okay? Um, you totally knocked him on his ass? Oh, come on, you totally saw it. That was legitimate self-defense. Hey, this is assault! You want me to call the police? I am the police. Now scram. What? A cop? Ah! I'm so sorry! No, wait, take this guy with you! Wow, not a great subordinate. <sighs> I guess this guy will come to eventually. Ah, well, folks, you all right now? Oof, did I just steal your thunder? <laughs> Sorry about that. Don't get too chummy. This man is most likely with public security. Ooh, good guess. Although, it may be more like common knowledge considering the number of tails on you. For example, you noticed the one over there yet? Dumbass, what are you doing? <laughs> Sorry, my bad. Could you bring this drunk in for me? What? The hell is with this guy? The suspicion level's off the charts. What does someone from public security want with us? Oh, no need for that look. I actually do have a reason to be here. I need to speak with you. Let's say we grab some coffee over there. Their curry's pretty killer, too. Enjoy. Sorry about that. We just despise the police, is all. It it's kind of weird when you say it with a smile like that. So? Why'd you rescue us? We'd appreciate it if you'd get to the point. Fine, fine. I'll skip the runaround and just tell you. I'm Zenkichi Hasegawa, an investigator on loan to Tokyo's public security branch. I'm officially an inspector. It's not a rank to sneeze at. Inspectors are not to be sneezed at. Okay, I got it. Uh, who said that? Whatever. I need to ask you something. 
Did you hear at all about that mess on the chat show the other day with Alice Hiragi? You're not good at playing stupid. Your face already told me you knew. Well, there's already been a full investigation into the incident. There was no indication the MC was planning to propose. Everyone questioned said he didn't even know who Alice was before this week. Not only that, he'd already been engaged to his co-host for however long. There isn't a whiff of motive to be found. So, the police have concluded, doesn't this sound like the work of the Phantom Thieves? Wait, you're saying... A whole lot of similar cases last year, no? Sudden personality shifts, abnormal behavior, psychotic breakdowns. If that MC went bonkers from a change of heart, you're gonna be suspect number one. The leader of the Phantom Thieves of Hearts. We don't know if it's drugs or hypnosis or what, but they want to charge you with criminal mischief. It's only a matter of time before you are arrested. But why? This is outrageous. What proof do you have? Sure it's outrageous, but we don't actually have any proof yet. That's why I'm here. So, level with me. Are you? Huh? Are you the one doing this? Hell no, dude! Yeah, yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, <laughs> just a second. Ah, uh, hello, Commissioner. Yes, I'm with the Phantom Thieves leader. I just asked for a confession, but he says he's innocent. Yes, that's right. <laughs> huh? Kidding? No, no, this is all real. That's enough nonsense? Oh, okay. I'm on my way to the office. <sighs> well... As you saw, I reported what you said to my boss. But if you ask me, mm, I don't think she's convinced. Did he really call his boss? Holy shit, what is with this guy? What are you trying to prove here? No matter how hard you claim to be innocent, there are people out there chomping at the bit to arrest you. If that ever happens, you're done for. And I'll be up the river too, because then this case will never get solved. So I wanted to make you an offer, or maybe more like a deal. A deal with you? I want to solve this case. To do that, I need the intel you've gathered. At the moment, I don't have anything that even resembles a lead. I'm totally at a loss. You, though, you just don't want to get arrested. I can do what needs to be done, so that won't happen. Your old men are a trustworthy lot in the force. There won't be any problems. Sounds like a fair deal to you? I appreciate you trying to see the benefit here. I really don't think it's a bad deal for you. Dude, hang on. Do you really think we should trust someone this shady? You know how they say the wise cat hides its claws? Let's just say that applies to me too. I've literally never heard that. What do you think? You don't have to do anything until you decide whether you trust him or not. That sure is a noisy cat. Uh, <clears throat> meow! Meow! Well, I don't need an answer right away. Get back to me once you think it over. I hope you'll see things my way, Phantom Thieves. All right, boss. Mm, be back soon for some curry. Sorry, the curry's 86th. For you. Oh, now that hurts. <laughs> what is with that guy? Ugh, he is absolutely ridiculous. He appears to have a great many bats in his belfry. Zenkichi Hasegawa? What a cool name for such a dweeb. But if he was telling the truth just now, they're gonna arrest him? Ah, uh, what a bullshit deal! I say it's more of a threat. Without a doubt, it still beats having him arrested. Walking into a trap isn't smart, but the intel might still pay off for us. Now that we know the police are on the move, we've already benefited from that guy. But now, the big question. How much can we trust him? I'm right there with you. It'd just be too risky. So, fess up. What'd you do this time? Mm, nothing. No worries, Sojiro. 
This is about that Alice girl, right? You're suspected of causing that whole mess on TV somehow. Is that it? Ugh. But it's totally bull. We know Alice is the one doing it. We're sorry, boss. We really didn't want to bother you again. Well, you didn't do it, right? So keep your chin up. If it's totally bull, then it's up to you to prove it. Boss! Chief really nailed it there. If you need anything, just let me know. Huh? Thank you, Sojiro. First things first, we take care of Alice. We can respond to the detective later. If Alice publicly admits to what she's been doing, it should clear our name anyway. Oh, right! Then we wouldn't even need to make a deal with him. Nevertheless, we've yet to find a way to get closer to Alice's castle. That wall really is our biggest problem. In trouble? I can help. We're trying to figure out a way past that damn wall. I'm sorry. I don't have a solution to that. How about hacking it, Utaba? Hmm, I could probably do something if it's linked directly to a terminal, but... A terminal? There is a control panel on the other side of the wall. What? Really? It was saved in my memory when we first confronted it. Therefore, really. Damn, I can't believe you remember that. What an eye, huh guys? It's A-I. Hmm? Who are you talking to? Have a friend on the phone? It's just your imagination, Sojiro. <laughs> it's almost like I've had my shop swiped from under my butt. That means you can lock up for me, right? I'm about to head out. And don't stay up too late, either. Got it? Roger. Well, don't overdo it. Now we have to figure out how we're going to get Futaba on the other side of the wall. Perhaps we could climb it with her? I don't think it's too high for us. There are too many searchlights in the area. We'd be quickly surrounded. We're going to need a decoy to put a dent in their defenses for us. One decoy? What do you think could actually pull that off? Who could be a decoy by themselves? Sorry, you're the only one who could pull this off. Now there's our leader! I knew you'd do it. Make a huge commotion to draw as much of the Shadow's attention as you can for us. This still sounds too dangerous, even for him. Shouldn't someone back him up? I can provide support. I will divide the enemy's attention between him and myself. This will lighten the burden placed upon you. Okay, I won't push myself too hard. Alright, we've got a plan. Now we just have to assign roles to the rest of the team. 